Hello everyone. So I've literally just got home and a video has been dropped by Beast of War which I'm incredibly excited about and I'm going to watch it with you um, as it has just come out. So we all know that in the Infinity the World, uh, Infinity the Game world, um, that Japan is uprising against Yujing. Uh, a naughty war corps has leaked some stuff uh, that caused things to come out last week that was earlier than expected and they've owned up to the fuck up. And so we know that Japan um, has almost sort of become separatist and coming away from Yujing. And in the law, they're quite an oppressed um, civilization against sort of the, the ISS and the Chinese. So they're breaking away. And this is really, really exciting. We've seen some leaks um, that an army box is coming out. And now we can confirm that next week is Beast of War week, which we were kind of anticipating. Um, and I think there are some previews of some of the models in this. So I'm going to watch it live with you guys and um, then we'll see where we get to. Okay, so it's a full army pack that's coming out. Ten figures, so it looks a little bit like the US Ariana Force. Kitty bike. That was a lot of cool figures. Okay, so what's this? Ooh, looks like the good book's coming out. Wow. I've actually got Goose pimples, goose dingles. Amazing, amazing. Right, I'm going to click back through and let's have a look at some of the things that was in that then. Okay, so we know there's an army pack coming out and there's 10 figures. Look at that fucking beast. Can we get a better picture? Okay, not the cleanest of pictures. Okay, so this guy looks kind of like the Cruiser Bora from Tunguska. What an absolute beast. It's like a massive Shikami. So, so nice. Um in the middle there and then we've kind of got like this dragon lady csu and she's pretty cool um i really like her i think everyone's a really good everyone's a really big fan of when you have that sort of minis with um little pets and she looks got she's got some sort of cat or something like that on her um and then let's scroll along a little bit then so he looks quite cool um not entirely sure. It looks like they've kind of kept the same sort of concept art with the Ketsubutu sort of trousers, which I really like because it's kind of like traditional Japanese sort of garments, isn't it? And then he's got a sick samurai sword and a nice little beard. Um, so 10 figures are coming. Another new little scenery pack. I suppose it's quite nice if you're getting into the game just to start off with that. Um, it looks like there's some um, special dice in the background there, which might be nice to collect. Um, the scenery doesn't look vastly different, I suppose, from Motortronica, um, which is a shame in terms of the, the look it's printed on. I might be wrong. The picture's not as clear as it could be. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, you can't have too much of that card terrain. It's, it's really good. So then what we got? So got these guys. Oh, let's go back a little bit. Got these guys. So they look like the Lion Troopers, maybe new Ketsu Butai. Um... I'm guessing that because of their trousers and just because they look like they've got combi rifles. And there's three of them, usually kind of a little bit of a giveaway. Um, kitty bike. <laughs> um, I'm not a massive fan of, of kind of the cat ears and the stuff like that, but I know there are going to be a lot of people who are. Um, not sure what's going on with the right eye, left, her right leg, but right us, right to us. Um, looks like an interesting bike as well it's a bit different from the ones we've seen which is nice it doesn't look like it's ones without wheels um, and that is a fucking badass scythe um, so that would be a nice interesting piece i suppose it's a bit like they did with the alf box um, they had um, penacea running up so um, which works quite well now this oh my god look at it it's like why would you not get this box if this is in it? Look at it. It's an absolute beast. Um, 
when we saw the concept artwork leaked a little while ago, I thought that was a tag, but it looks like it's a Crucibora sort of size, um, 40 mil base. Um, so heavy infantry, I suppose. Shukami, he doesn't look like he's got a gun on him. He's got two weapons, two samurai swords. Um, absolutely fucking beautiful. I will be getting that without a shadow of a doubt. Um, so you get everything in the box. Looks over here like there's some, on the left hand side, it looks like there's a new ninja on the right hand side. Not quite sure what that is. Um, so let's carry on. Let's click on a little bit. Okay. So this is the main again. So it looks like you've got some, a range of weapons in there. There looks like there to be a heavy rocket launcher, or a heavy missile launcher in the center there. And that guy looks like, I'll show you on the artwork when we get to it, but it looks like Bato out of um, out about a ghost in the shell. And I don't think this is a new ninja perhaps. Nice little two-toed feet there. <clears throat> oh, that's nice. That's really nice. The paint job and the and, and the, the the sculpt just looks so clean. It looks really nice. And I quite like these new masks they've got. They all look like they've got a little bit of gas masks on them. Um, and this CSU. That that's beautiful. That is really, really nice. Um I think everyone was really impressed when the Dragon Lady came out, and I think they'll be the same when they get their hands on this. Okay, here is some of the artwork that I wanted to just quickly reference. Oh, got this. Yeah, so it looks like there's going to be a new book out, which is interesting. So the new book from Corsoli that will bring the non-aligned armies. Non-aligned. So I suppose that sounds a little bit like mercenaries. You get a mercenary enforcer with it. Um, so perhaps, maybe, this is going to be a merc army, a bit like the Druze. So... They're not necessarily under you. Um, not that they'd be under using it anyway, because they're they're coming away from it. Um, but that's interesting that they're getting a book. Whether that's going to lead to a campaign or not. So oh, I really like this artwork. Really, really cool. Um, she reminds me of Major from Ghost in the Shell. I think we've already had one though. Um, Kitty bike, which a lot of people I think are going to like. Where's he? Bato, literally Bato, look at his eyes, um, and his heavy pistol, so pretty cool, pretty cool indeed, so that starts next Monday on the 5th, I'm really excited for that, um, obviously this maybe suggests that the Aurora is going to be in that as well, uh, in the army, so um, really, really excited for that 300 point boxer to ship uh, and to come out, we know that it's um, 99, I think, was it Australian dollars I saw on another leak come from um, Game Trade magazine. So really, really exciting to see that. Um, I'm going to put some stills up of the pictures now um, so you guys can have a thumb through. But what a week we're going to have next week. All right. I'll catch you guys later.